Hey guys, it's your girl Maya. So just kind of doing like a normal um, vlog. So let me get a little bit more comfortable. Um, yeah, so I don't do vlogs a lot because I've been lazy, but um, yeah, decided to do them because uh, doing live streams is great, but I can't stay on topic with like one subject. Um, and they're so long, they're like hours long, so I wouldn't expect anyone to sit there and watch all of them. So like, you know, if there's a specific topic I want to share, which I want to share a topic tonight, um, I will do a vlog. So anyway, <laughs> so as some of you may know, um, if you don't, if you're new to my channel and stuff like that, I make friendship bracelets and it sounds really silly and stuff like that, but um, it gets pretty like, you know, advanced and stuff and I just like want to show off some of the bracelets that I have made. Um, yeah, because it's like one of the only things in my life that I'm like really, really proud of and I'm like I really believe that I have a talent with this. So, yeah. Um, I just drink myself dry in the mouth, so <laughs> you take a drink. And then I will start showing off the bracelets. Promise. <laughs> That's what you came here for. All right. So I've been doing this since I was 11, I believe. Um, pretty simple pattern. I don't know if you can see it very well. But this is a Chinese staircase and it's just like, it's so cool. Really simple pattern. Um, learning how to get like the stair staircase like right is really hard though. Um, here's a cute little one that I made. The chevron is what they call this pattern. Um, it's one that I do a lot because it's really easy. Um, well, this one you probably really can't see the pattern, but I think, yeah, it has X's in it and I like it. Really easy pattern to do and yeah. <laughs> um, this is what is called the, I guess, the basket weave, but like there's another basket weave, but this is like a variation of it where you like have these little, and it just like, I don't know, it just takes it to the next level. I don't think I have a regular basket weave um, bracelet because after I figured out how to do it like this, I was like, no, nah, I'm just going to do it like this. <laughs> but yeah, no, I don't have any. Um, it's another one that I made in the same colors, but a little... Ooh, yeah, it's smaller, thinner, I don't know. <laughs> um, hold on, I'm going to keep it on. Cause I, I, I do these a lot because they're really fun and they always turn out really cute. And yeah, try to keep the patterns together. I should have prepared myself before this and like got the patterns all, you know. Oh, well, here's a regular basket weave that I have. Yeah, see how it's just like... It just pumps up the volume, you know? <laughs> um, that, no, I have another basket weave. I really like that one. Um, yeah, I think that's all for the basket, but nope, no, it's not. <laughs> I should have prepared for this. This one's kind of like, I don't know, I got kind of messed up, smushed or something. I don't know, but it's still cute. Um, okay. Here's another chevron, but this one has a border, which is always really fun to put the borders on because it just gives it like a little pop, you know. <laughs> and I have, oh God, I found another basket weave. I guess we're just not going to be doing these in any kind of order. I'm just going to be showing you the bracelets as they come. So I really like this one. That's pretty. Um, yeah, sometimes I forget the bracelets that I make because I make so many. Um, here's another chevron with a border. Uh, this is kind of annoying because it like it tends to like roll up like that, so I have to like continuously like stretch it out and shit. Um, here's a little pattern that I learned to do, kind of difficult. It's hair everywhere. Um, super cute though. I love it. Here's another really. Oh my god, this is a really hard pattern. This is like so hard and I think you can see why <laughs> lots of different I don't know it's just it's cute I love it I have another one that's made in this style but in different colors it's 
so it's like the cute thing. I don't know. <laughs> it's another bordered chevron. This is a leaf bracelet. I love these. I have a lot of these. Get ready for these. Okay. I have this one that is extra long so I can uh, double it up on my wrist. It's so pretty. I love it so much. Oh my god. Um, here's a leaf pattern I did with like some like leftover strings that I had and it's not super pretty but whatever. <laughs> Um, okay, and this is called a squiggle. So it's the squiggle pattern, and I love it. I have a lot of these, so get ready. Um, cute little pink ones I don't really wear, but whatever. This one. I love to play with colors and color schemes and palettes and whatever. Oh, here's another leaf pattern for you guys. This one's kind of old, so it's pretty dirty. Um, another squeagle. Squeagle. I love these. They're really easy to make. They don't take long to make at all. Um, this is the heart pattern. I know quite a few heart patterns. This is one of the coolest ones because it's so very obviously a heart. Here's another leaf one that looks like leaves because it's green. <laughs> um, yeah. Um, here's a pattern that I did, like kind of like fishes, fishes, fish. <laughs> I kind of messed it up right here and did it like twice, but it, it, I think it looks cool. Whatever. This is a little crazy pattern that I did. I really like it. It's all fucking cool. It's just. It gives me like 80s vibes, I guess. I don't know. Especially the colors. I love it. Um, this is like, I'm not really sure what it's supposed to be. I guess it's X's, but and then like, like an X in the middle, and that, then like a side of an X, and the side of an X, and then an X in the middle. I guess that's what it's going for. Um, I kind of like it. It's kind of cool. <laughs> um, it's another pattern that I've done. I like the colors, they're really cool. Um, ooh, here's another pattern that's really fun to make. These are like zigzag bracelets, I think you can call them zigzag. Um, but they just look really, really fucking cool. They're like, I don't know, super cool. Really easy to make. Um, <laughs> and another squiggle. Squiggles. Gotta love the squiggles. Um, here's this one that I made, um, that I learned recently, and it's really easy, and, like, if you do this, you can, like, make it, like, fancier, I guess, but it doesn't stay like that, so, yeah. <laughs> here's another really cute zigzag. I love the color scheme on this one. They look better if you turn them around. Um. I just, I love playing with colors and just like putting random colors together and seeing what they look like. Um, this is another zigzag that is the same color as that um, really pretty leaf pattern one that I have. I just really, really liked these colors together, so I had to do two different bracelets. Out of black right now, but I plan on buying some black string. Another pretty bracelet, kind of rainbowy. Not all the colors are the rainbow, but most of them. Um, I already showed you that one. Um, <laughs> this is like a little diamond. It's kind of like the green one that I made, except I made this one first, so it looks kind of crappy because it was the first time I made this pattern. Um, fuck, I lost the green one. That's okay. Whatever, it's just like this diamond pattern that I did that's just like, you know, this one looks a little messed up, but I really like the colors, they're all earthy and shit. Anyway. Another one with earth tones, a squiggle bracelet, super cool. 
This is another simple chevron. This one's kind of old. You can tell by, you know, the color fading and stuff, but I still love it. There's another squiggle, pretty old. Most of my squiggles are pretty old. Also, they uh, tend to wear out faster than the other bracelets, just because I guess I'm not really sure. Ooh, here's another leaf pattern. It kind of like broke a little bit. Some of the strings broke, um, but it's still pretty. Um, oof, I like this one a lot. It's like a little heart pattern. A cute little like zigzaggy type situation going on. Love it. Here's another bordered chevron, old one can tell by how stiff it is and dirty. <laughs> uh, showed you that one already. Okay. <laughs> Another pretty chevron. Cute colors that I put together. Just, I love, I love putting colors together. And these colors, like, remind me of cotton candy really, really bad. Ooh, and it matches my dress pretty good, too. Love that. Okay. <laughs> Here's another one of the kind of crazy, like, kind of reminds me of the 80s style. Uh, here's one of my favorite chevrons. It's kind of old, but I still love it so much because it just turned out so super cool. Um, yeah. And here's another one that's like supposed to look like hearts, but this is the first one I've ever made, so it's kind of like not good. <laughs> Need some practice with this one, but that's okay. This is one of my favorites that I've ever made, ever, ever. This pattern is so cute. It's like butterflies or bows or bows. It's just, it's everything. That's why I need more black because I want to make tons of these with like the black background because it just looks so fucking cute. Anyway. <laughs> Ooh, another bordered chevron and some cute colors. I really like these colors. Ooh. Okay, well, here's a better version of that brown one. Um, it turned out way better. I think this is probably the second one that I made with just some reddish colors, you know. Sometimes I like to do, like, uh, one color, but, like, different shades and stuff like that. It's always fun. A bunch of bracelets that I did not make. I like this one. It's really pretty. Cool colors. Um, here's just like, it's kind of like a chevron, except you only do one side. It's not one of my favorites to make, um, it just doesn't look as fancy as a chevron, but it's pretty cool. It's kind of like, eh, like a candy cane, I guess. I don't know. Here's another squeagle. The color choices kind of give me, like, 80s, you know. <laughs> Another squiggle. Did I show? I think I showed you this guy. This that. I think I showed you this one already, or one similar to it. I, I like to do the squiggles. They're very easy. Oh, I haven't seen this one in a long time. This is another um, bordered chevron. I really like doing these. It just looks so cool and so simple, but fantastic. Oh. Another, oh no, I showed you this one already. <laughs> okay. Um, this one's really cool. It's just like a simple little circle situation going on. Um, I love it. Uh, da -da -da -da. Oh, I really like this one. It turned out really cool, like this weird zigzaggy pattern. Um, I experimented with like, um, like two colored, really thin bracelets and this is one of them that I made, and I really like it. I'm gonna make more like it. Um, ooh, this gives me like candy cane vibes for real. It's perfect for this time of year, Christmas time. Ooh, yeah, I like that. That's cute. I like that. Um, little purple diamondy situation that I have going on right here. Um, I think I have one in progress that's similar to this. Another chevron, or just play around with colors and stuff like that. And they usually turn out really fucking cool, so. And 
I guess this is just, yeah, this is just a regular chevron that I made in green and brown because I think they look really good together. And I think that's it. Yeah, that's it for what I have um, right now. I will show you the two works in progress that I have. This one's really fucking cool and it's almost done. Yeah. It's all tangled into another bracelet. That's gonna happen sometimes. So uh, this is my cute little work in progress. I'm really excited about it. It's so cute. I love it. I love the colors. <sighs> yes. And my other work in progress is really cool. It is a pattern that I'm just now learning and it's so cute. Like it, it really is a work in progress. I got one, yeah, one little part done. Um, so yeah, some of you guys ask me what I like to do in my free time besides like react to videos, listen to music and stuff like that, and smoke weed. Um, making bracelets, I absolutely adore it. It's one of the best things in the world. It's just epic. <laughs> but yeah, I hope you enjoyed that, and um, yeah, I hope that you enjoy, you know, I'll have to think up ideas for like vlogs and stuff but i hope that you enjoyed this and that you enjoy any future vlogs that i have and yeah i do have a playlist that this video is probably going to be in um you know a playlist for like vlogs and stuff like that when i did vlogs like two years ago um you can check those out if you want to i'm a little different than i was in those vlogs but <laughs> i guess they're still pretty interesting i don't know um, there's some vlogs where i show off artwork and show off like little tiny knickknacks that I have and stuff like that. Just like, you know, if you ever want to get to know me and I'm not live, so, but I'm probably going to go live after I upload this video. So, but I hope you guys enjoyed that. I really do. And thank you for watching. Thank you for being interested in my life. It makes me feel good. <laughs> and I love you guys. And I hope you're all happy and healthy. And uh, I hope your life is as beautiful as you are. So, <laughs> Daisuke, that means I love you. Matane, that means see you later in Japanese. And bye-bye, that means bye-bye. <laughs>